Are we back? Oh, my camera looks like shit. Why does it look like shit? My settings decide to fucking... There we go. Is this better? Yeah. Um, oh, great! And the rest of my camera settings decided to, to reset. Very cool. Um... Okay. I think we're good. So that was the thing. Interesting. We back. The game is back. Remember how I told you about Bob? No. No. <laughs> Gotta be honest. No. Um. I don't remember shit. Was I high? Was I high? Power might go out again. No. I was okay, so yeah, no, I definitely don't remember. Like you could literally con like anybody could can just confess their love to me when I'm high. When I'm when I'm baked. And I won't I won't remember. Not out of like, you know like, you know, any bad feelings or anything. It's just I just physic mentally just cannot remember. Um I am I don't know, I've been kind of thinking about that lately, where I feel like it's actually getting really bad. Ah! It's actually really getting bad, because I tried to make a phone call um, the other day, I think yesterday, and I, could, I couldn't remember anything that the, the girl on the line was saying. I tried to write things down, but the thing is, like, if I try to write things down as she... <laughs> as she's saying it I won't like I'll forget what I'm typing I guess and I'll just kind of stop in the middle of it and I'll be like wait what is this for again um obviously it gets worse when I'm high but I just feel like it's getting worse in general and that kind of scares me I don't want to forget things so yeah All the camera settings reset. Ugh, that's annoying. It's a 6 p.m. Oh my goodness. Um, it's a totally 100% bad feelings. How dare you? Absolutely not. I get that feeling. Yeah, it's it sucks. Um, and uh, it sucks a lot because. Sometimes I want to talk about something to either on stream or to other people. Ah, fuck. I'm gonna sneeze. Shit. Um. <clears throat> but I, I forget what I'm gonna say. Just like I just did right now. I wanted to say something else. But I forgot. It's that bad. Brain fog and memory loss from exhaustion be really scary yep can I borrow a pack of cigarettes late I don't know what you're talking about I don't have cigarettes Trina I do not have cigarettes absolutely not I would never smoke <laughs> why would you do this to me Trina why would you do that to me <laughs> uh it's fine. And yes. It's alright. It's alright. Um, I always do that thing during a conversation where I really want to tell someone something, but they're talking and then they finish and I forget. Yuki! Oh, Mommy Wee. You amazing bean. Love you. Hey, I. You doing good? You're the amazing bean. What? Um, Yuki, thank you for 10 fucking months. Holy shit. Thank you for the shinies in chat. 
for the the lovely kid. Welcome to Hellzong. Um, I am doing pretty good today, aside from being sick, a little sick, which is which is annoying. Um, but I'm glad I streamed. <coughs> glad I streamed. But uh, but yeah, how are you? Um. Paradox Valorant, welcome to the stream. Is that the same paradox that's in the um, trepidation Discord? If so, welcome, welcome. Thanks for coming to hang out. Boz Orange. Oh, excuse me, I have hiccups. Um, on mobile. Boz pink to me. Ah, I got hiccups. Oh no. <laughs> what is with me today? I'm sick. I'm forgetting shit. <clears throat> and now I have hiccups. I had hiccups earlier today too. Hold my breath. That does not work. It does not work. Oh, I have a tummy ache now after hiccuping. It's not like sometimes there's good hiccups where it's like, oh, that was a good feeling, you know? It's like, it's a very satisfying hiccup. But these hiccups were like, no, these were like, ah, eh, I don't know. It scare the hiccups out of you? We should just play a horror game. Trina, not gonna lie, you're, you're not very scary, <laughs> you know? <laughs> I mean, hold a knife to my neck, then I'll be very- I, then I'll be scared, you know? But don't do that. <laughs> Time for prognostic. Good, I don't think I could, uh, play a scary game like this. Warm milk is actually a solution because it's a muscle spasm. Heat relaxes the muscle. I thought warm beverages made it, uh, that's what causes hiccups, right? <laughs> Friend chief. Yeah. Um. Yuki, how are you doing? How's your day, Yuki? They help, really? Hiccups are weird. Why do we sneeze? And why do we hiccup? Why do we do anything? Why do we have, like, body... Bodies? Why do they exist? What the fuck is that, Scruggs? Is that a fucking, uh... Spore creature? That's a spore creature right there. It's a spasm of the diaphragm? But why? Trina. You good? Just got finished watching uh, us Swedes choosing who to send to Eurovision. I don't know what that is. I don't know anything about Europe. Uh, and an artist uh, I wanted to send one. Ooh. So that was nice. A bad thing, though. That my second monitor, which has uh, been on death's door for a while, gave up at last. Feels weird to only have one monitor now. Um, also had a bad evening since I had to do dishes, but now that you're streaming, my evening got a lot better. Oh, that's a big mood. That's a big mood. I, uh, <coughs> I haven't really done dishes for my whole life. We've always had a dishwasher. So now for the first time, we don't have a dishwasher. And I, I, uh, I, I, I uh, I look at my bowl in the sink and I'm like, but my hands would get wet and there's like germs and I don't want to get wet you know yeah I feel like it might be an OCD thing I don't know maybe it's like maybe it's not even that bad but um I, I just I just have a very strong reaction. I can do it still sometimes, but use a brush. Well, you still have to hold it. You know, you still gotta get your hands wet. So as you get your uh, your hands all all in there and nice and nice and dirty. Anyway, um, Yuki, I'm sorry to hear that about about your monitor. That really sucks. Um, but I hope you can get a new one. A nice new one. I feel like, let me adjust the uh, contrast on this camera here. 
Um, now that you're streaming, my evening got a lot better. Aww. It's really nice to see you. I hope, uh... I hope your evening continues to improve. Sneezing is to inject germs that could be harmful. Keep the germs in my body. I'll fuck them up. My, uh, my, my immune system will be like, Bitch, what you trying to do? Oh, evaporate them. Evaporate? Vaporize. You get a muscle spasm anywhere in your body? I heard, so I've been looking up, I, I feel like I have something called chronic hiccups. Um, where, I mean, as a lot of you know, I hiccup a lot. But it's not like a continuous hiccup thing. It's like I will hiccup at least once a day. Sometimes I miss a day or two. But for the most part, I, I hiccup at least once a day, just out of nowhere. And it, it combines with my burps a lot. So it will be like a half hiccup, half burp. And uh, I heard some people tell me uh, that apparently I could have cancer because of it. Ha <laughs> Could be a neuro neurodivergent thing. Perhaps. Perhaps. Speaking of that, I started the process of getting therapy. And hopefully, uh, pills. To hope hopefully we get some happy pills. You know, aside from my, my titty skills. Get a pair of like rubber gloves with long sleeves. Maybe. Maybe. Maybe I'm just lazy. I I'm probably just lazy. Well, 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 look who it is. What? It's like I'm like your arch nemesis or something. <laughs> Glacy. The one and only Glacy. With the, the, the power of ice. I don't know. I feel like Glacy just kind of reminds me of like Glacier. So I feel like you would have like ice powers. You'd be like the ice queen. Anyway, how are you doing? Sometimes your hiccup is just a yelp. That can be acid reflux. I don't think I have acid reflux. Whoa! Nice seeing you again. It's nice seeing you too! Holy fuck, 13 months! So many shinies today! Thank you, thank you, thank you! Ah, I'm glad I streamed today! Um, I hope you've been doing well, Glacy. I hope, I hope you've been having fun with the Destiny 2 expansion. I heard it's heard it's very, very good. Lots of good stuff uh, from that expansion, so I bet you're, you're super happy with it. My hiccups scare the shit out of you! That's kind of funny. <laughs> I thought my hiccups are cute. Acid reflux is the most common because uh, of single hic hiccups and burps like that. I thought acid reflux is like, I used to get it when I was a kid because uh, I would eat like shit. Um, and uh, I would feel it in my stomach and lungs a lot. But now I haven't felt it in a very long time. Hopefully I get my happy pills soon. Me and you both. You are lazy. What? <clears throat> I grew up without a dishwasher. When this new place had one, but the people still washed by hand. I'm like, why? Yeah. I hate the feeling some dishwashers leave glasses with. Uh, weird feeling. I know exactly what you're talking about. It's when glasses get uh, really hot. And you feel them, and they're like, you can't explain the feeling. I don't fucking know. Um, but I hate it. Yeah. I have, I have very, um, like, I'm just kind of realizing, I'm realizing a lot lately. But I have very s specific and weird sensory issues, or I don't know what the word is. Um, but it's cer certain things that really bother me, or it's certain 
um, what's the word? Compulsions. Sensory compulsions that I need. Fidget toys and, and like, you know, fidget items help me with that. Um, and they, they help me relieve the, those, uh, like, those compulsions. Um, but it, it also just kind of happens around my body, too. It happens with my, my, uh, feet a lot. Where, uh, I hate, hate not wearing socks. Except, uh, unless I'm sleeping, or in the shower, obviously. Um, I cannot be barefooted anywhere, aside from sleeping and in the shower. I will cry. Do you have a concept of bad texture? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what that, like, I don't really know what that is, you know? I would need, like, a good description and, like, an example. Sounds like autism, to be honest. That would be, that would be, if I, if I go to the fucking, uh, therapist or wh wh whatever to, to get diagnosed, I am just, like, I would not, I've never have expected that, honestly. It'd be fine. I just want to know. I just want to know. That's the big thing. Showers with socks on. Don't believe her. I absolutely do not shower with socks. This is this is uh, this is harassment. I I don't know how you could do that to me. My brother has that kind of thing, and he's diagnosed autistic. What were, so wait, what were, we're talking about the sensory thing, right? The sensory compulsions? Does that seem to be commonly linked with autism? I thought it was linked with OCD. Well, it could- well, I guess it could be both. Sounds rather neurodivergent in one way or another. That's why I've been so sure you know, this past couple months that I've really been just kind of delving into it. Um, that I must have something. You know, I, I it's just, yeah. Lies and slander. One sec. tell you grace and trina bought the biggest fucking apples last night that i've ever seen in my life these motherfuckers look like watermelons they look like okay like mini watermelons all right it, it was a whole meal just to eat one apple they were like if i have something i don't have something to like compare it to um okay this was about two apples with its like it's uh like a grapefruit yeah i bring one to show to show clearly not to eat i would it's not like i want an apple or anything i you know just to show the audience you know this is what the apple looks like because clearly that's what they want to know it's not like i want to eat it anyway OCD can be comorbid. What does comorbid mean? Can be comorbid with autism. Okay, so bad texture, right? When you touch a thing, people normally don't have issues with, but that gives you big icky. It's not icky, it's just discomfort. You know? Yeah.
Sorry, has fooled Treat into delivering food. <laughs> My plan is coming together. can't eat grapefruit because it interferes with my medication. Does it really? Oh, I heard about that actually. It does. It does. Like, that's a, a common thing. That's wild. For me, it's extreme discomfort. It depends on what it is for me to have it extreme. It also depends on the mood that I'm in. Um, it's... I suppose it's also... I wash her dishes and bring her food. Oh, oh God. Am I the me? Listen, I'm gonna be the one buying the dishwasher, so it's okay. Possum made. <laughs> Put on the maid dress. I'm gonna be the maid that just, that wears the maid dress, but I don't, I don't actually do anything. I just kind of stand there. Anyway, what was I going to say? I was going to say that, like, there was this one instance. I don't know what to attribute this to. But it, it, it really kind of stuck with me. Where, uh... <gasps> Apple's here! Ah, wow, um... That's what it feels like to be called master. I don't like- Uh, well, uh, anyway. I dropped something. I don't know what I dropped. Anyway! <laughs> this is how big the fucking apple is. I can't wrap my palm around it. I can't- My hand- I have really small hands, but like... I can't, like... Ah, my eye. Owie. Why does my eye sting? Do I have makeup in my eye? Oh, I have it on my hands now. Apple? That's a regular size apple? What? It's a massive apple. You know? That's ma maybe not massive, but it's on the bigger side, you know? Um. I'm seen bigger. Are you making fun of my apple? Are you making fun of the size of my apple? I tried my best to get to, you know, to show y'all as, as big of an apple as I could, okay? I grew this apple myself, you know? I grew it myself. I got it all nice and uh, nice and warmed up <laughs> beforehand to make it as big. Anyway, I'm gonna stop there. Bite the apple. Y'all want some apple ASMR? <laughs> It's- My mouth is tiny! I can't even bite into it! My mouth is like so fucking tiny. Anyway. It's not that crispy. It could be harder. It could be harder. Oh, fuck. Um. Okay. So, I, I would like your guys' opinion. On what the fuck this could have been. Maybe I'm just... I'm just fucking needy. I don't know. I might have just been emotional. But, uh... It was when we were first, uh, the first few days that we moved here, I think. Probably like the first week or two. And we were setting up, uh, downstairs and setting up, no, actually we were moving in, uh, all of their, their furniture and all of their stuff from, from their U-Haul. And I was helping out every now and then, and I would go up to my room to put something in my room or whatever. And then I would get very distracted and be like, I was like, I need to hang these up. I need to fix this. I think one of them was broken. Like one of the, like it fell off, right? And uh, I was like, I need to fix this right now. 
I need to fix this right now, you know, or else I, you know, I don't know. I just need to fix it right now. And then Grace came up and, you know, Grace uh, told me that, you know, they needed help downstairs. And I started the panic. Uh, like, I, I, I think I was hyperventilating. I think Grace might remember, but Grace isn't here right now. Uh, but she had to calm me down and she had to, like, sit me down for a second and be like, it's okay. We'll come back to it later and reassure me and things like that. But for a little bit there, I was like, I was freaking out because I couldn't do what I set my mind to do was to fix this. And I was like, it was bothering me so goddamn much that um, I wasn't able to fix it at that moment, you know? Um, but once, you know, once she sat me down and, and everything, uh, sneeze. Achoo! <sighs> That was a long time coming. Finally. Uh. Yay, I sneezed. Sounds like OCD. Absolutely OCD. Result of something else. Trans transference? Transference? A long time coming. Oh. down as a result of being asked uh, what I wanted for lunch because I was stressed about something else going on. I wasn't even stressed. That's the thing. I wasn't really like panicking about anything else. There wasn't really a whole lot on my mind. Obviously the move was like a lot and everything but be it sick I'll, I'll actually cry. Why? I won't. I won't. I'll be fine tomorrow. Like absolutely will be fine tomorrow. My sickness is only last a day, at most. I never get sick uh, for more than one day. Heal! <gasps> I'm better now! DSM-5 before you start therapy, what is that? the things you relate to and bring it bring it to your shrink bring it up to your shrink my shrink what uh, my what my what now People lingo. I'm in therapy. I don't even know what that is. Psychologist. I've never heard it called that way. Okay, I need like I need like a five minute break or something to walk around the house for a sec and just get everything out of my nose because this ain't working. So I apologize, but I'll be back and I'll be back in a couple minutes.
damn, that was a good fucking apple. I forgot to take this off. I tied my hair. I hate how my hair looks in a ponytail. I don't. I, I feel like I look like shit in a ponytail. I don't know. Here comes the girl. Whoa. Hello, girl. Hello, sick girl. Here she looks is. cute. I don't think she so. I don't know. Thank you, though. Excuse me. Nuggies! I love nuggies. Yeah! Wait, do, we don't have ketchup. You can't eat nuggies without ketchup. Well, I could still have some. Not a lot. Um, I thought it looked super cute. Ah, I was surprised to see it tied back, but I like he. I have it tied back like most of my day actually, um, and and uh, in my sleep because my hair is just annoying. I eat the apple. I do, but only a few. Um. Also, we had paradox in chat. Hello, hello. Uh, setting a world record for trepidation. Very nice. Very cool. And, uh, yeah. Big Apple and Nuggies. It's like a dream come true. I get, uh... Little turfy... Turf... Tufty bits of hair by the sides of my head when I put it in a ponytail. I just, uh... I don't know. I don't like my bangs. Or not my bangs, but like just the... I, I just feel like... I just, I don't like my facial structure. Um, it's fine when I have hair around my face to kind of promote the more feminine features. Um, but without hair here, it's it, there's really like... I don't like it. <laughs> I, I feel like I... I, I, I uh, look like a dude in a ponytail. Hey, Trina. Mari likes Safari. Chat Mari. <laughs> now you are actually Chat Mari. I am the streamer Mari now. <laughs> How are you doing? You have barbecue sauce? Oh, okay. I'll have some. I escaped the nether interpretation. Four minutes, nine seconds. That's very cool. Good run, good run. Now get sub three minutes. Technically, technically, it is possible to get a, like a two minute run if you spawn next to a nether fortress and get lucky with the uh, time stop uh, stopwatches in the chests. I think maybe even less than two minutes. It depends. Like, if you really got a good spawn and you spawn, like, next to a fucking nether chest or, or another fortress chest, you can be, like... You might just be able to get it, like, at the same time. You know? But there's a 30-second window, actually, so I don't know. Multiple Maris. Yeah, were you saying I feel the same? What, about chicken nuggets? Or about your hair? I much prefer my hair down. Okay, okay. Just a shame because I, uh, my hair gets greasy super quick. I can only wash it every three days because the whole process tires me out. Uh, so I have it... I have it to have it in a ponytail for at least a couple days in a week. Ah, I see, I see. I just don't usually care how I look around the house. You know, if I'm taking pictures or if I go outside or if I'm on stream, I, I obviously care how I look. You get no minutes if you never open it. This is true. You'll be incredibly lucky. Spawn next to gas bones. You do care? Okay. I mean, yeah, to an extent. But the the benefit of having the, the ponytail, you know, with the hair not being in my face and in my mouth, 
is far greater than any, you know, care, I guess, that I have for my appearance at, at home, you know? Oh, a lot of mirrors, okay. Yeah, I could see that then. Waifu? Where? I don't see- I don't see any goth waifus around here. Not me. I'm just the stinky old little- little- little, uh, little sh stinky. Anyway. Hi, Mago Wizard. How you doing? How you been? Welcome back. Sorry, putting my hair in a ponytail because, uh, like hair getting in my face. Oh, because like hair getting in my face all the time. Yeah, it's annoying. <laughs> Mari Goth wife, you're right there in your chair. There's a there's a girl sitting in my chair. That's crazy. Well, it's good for your skin to have your hair out of your face as well. Oh, hi wizard. How are you? Um, what was I gonna say? Oh yeah, we're going to Renaissance Fair. Um, in August, or no, in, in the fall, and this may not be set in stone, but we're gonna try. But I want to dress as a samurai for Renaissance Fair. Um, it's gonna be hard and expensive, probably, and take a lot of time. Grace is gonna help. I just hiccup while I coughed. I hate that. Sammy, Sam, 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 why, Sam, why? Yeah, because I have swords now. I have a heckin' sword. Imagine, imagine me in a full samurai outfit, right? With this by my side. Imagine that. A full samurai, like a, um, like an armored outfit, right? An armored outfit. This is display, by the way. This is not real. Ah. I don't know why it gets, like, stuck here. It gets stuck. And I, I have to, like, like, kind of fiddle it in. There you go. Um... Oh yeah, God, that would be so cool. Your sword is so big. Oh, thank you. I, uh, I worked hard on my sword. Just for you. Uh, also got pierced for the first time since last time I was here as well. Oh, since the last time I was here as well. Yo, that's awesome. I have never gotten piercing, piercings before. And I don't know if I will. Maybe. Um... I don't even have earrings. I just don't like it. I don't like piercings. I don't know. Too much work. Ro Rowan or full samurai armor? I don't know. Uh, I can... Uh, Grace has the references, so... Yeah, I don't know. But if it's too hard to do that... Um, I'm gonna swap it to, like, a kimono outfit. Um... Because that's not as hard to do as making fucking armor. You know? You know, with like the, the wood shoes and everything. Um, I won't be able to wear socks, which really sucks. 
You know, I think we all know how much I love my socks. Septum, septum would look good on you. Where, where's the septum? Chris and I are going as battle barmaids. Isn't that the, the same one from last year, right? Me comfy eating GF spaghetti while playing Stardew. Ooh, that sounds very, very comfy. Very, very cute. Hell yeah. Here we go with the swords again. I love swords. It's, I have, it's become a fidget toy. It should not have, but it's become a fidget toy for me just to kind of pull out the sword and then put it back in. I'm just kind of do that every now and then. Oh, middle of the nose? Um, I don't know. It makes me uncomfortable, especially with how sick I get, you know? I would be if, like, my first piercing would probably be, uh, mouth. Like, our lip piercing, I mean. Because I've tried on, like, the fake ones before, and it looked really good, so... Uh, you can do what I do and get fox piercings. What is that? Vagabond and a witch, respectively. Oh, yeah. Yeah, which was the first idea? You know, originally, I was gonna go as a witch, which felt right, and felt felt right, but then Samurai is just so much cooler to me. Samurai is just so much cooler. I love, I love Samurais. Um... Lip piercing would look adorable on you, are you? <gasps> wow. I have some over there. I'll put it on. See, the problem is, these suck ass, so that's why I don't wear them. They, they, uh... They're too big. They fall off very easily. Box piercing? <laughs> I can't talk with with the, with this on. That's the thing. I can't I can't talk or else it just like fucking falls off, so a little big and I can't I can't talk it, it'll fall off if my lips kind of kind of smack oh you have some okay okay yeah I'll try it on I would love to, I would love to have it have it on like most of the most of the time so I think I think it looks really cool But yee. Looks really natural on you. It goes really good with my makeup. Um, yeah. I think it'll look cool if I if I have my full makeup uh, thing and some some cool face tats. You know, the whole the whole nine yards. Why do they call it the whole nine yards? What is what is nine yards? What is nine yards long? Where does that come from? I need to know now. Thank you, Yuki. Is that how long like a football field is or something? Didn't they name yards after football or something? Or the other way around. Don't mind me being dumb bitch right now. Oh, I'm right! I was right about that. Fucking America with their, their fucking... The fucking football. Hand egg field. I haven't been looking at uh, punk clothes. I noticed when you look for punk clothes, it's uh, all good and stuff. We start looking at specifically female punk, it mostly just becomes goth and emo. What's with that? 
I would say punk is pretty gender neutral, in my opinion. Uh, at least, uh, not not always. Um, but just I would say, for the most part, whatever whatever guys wear as punk fashion, girls can also wear. Um. So yeah. Smart. American rugby. What is rugby? I don't. I hear rugby all the time, but I don't know what it is. Is that like rugby is like football, but in Europe or something? You sure it's okay? Thank you. Nee. Thank you. Oh, these are oh, these look cool. Okay, okay, cool. Okay. So, is it like the the kind of square side that goes inside my lip. Yeah, that makes sense. Um, good. It doesn't. It's definitely smaller than the other one, but I do have to push them in every now and then because they kind of like hit my teeth and they just kind of like fall back out. Yeah, I like I like the ones with like the single though. Mm -hmm. Let me try uh let me try this one. Try it on the side. Let's see if you can the center, like the bottom lip? Yeah, the center or the bottom lip. Let's see if we can get control. Ooh. Actually, yeah. That looks <laughs> but I have to talk like like I have a lisp with it though, cause well, it... Oh, that's true. It's it's definitely not perfect. I would I would need a real piercing because it's it. If I'm not really talking and if I'm just going outside to buy groceries or, or whatever, then then yeah. But I. That's true. <laughs> but um. I don't know. Yeah. Oh, definitely for pictures. Um, eyebrow piercing? I don't know. I don't really want to think about piercings. I want to get tattoos first. No, I do. I don't want to look at that. Oh, I meant I meant for wrinkles. When when wrinkles like happen with the tattoo, like ugh. No, never mind. Yeah. Um. My chicken nuggies. Yeah. Um. So great on ya. Thank you. You have a psh, dab. That was a shitty dab, but I don't want to like fucking just fucking punch through my wall, you know? The powerful dab. Or break my fingers. That too. <coughs> Rat squeak. Dab was too strong. Dab was too strong. I broke through my wall and broke my fingers.
so many bands I'll get to see live for the first time. Oh, I'm super hyped for the punk festival in August. Ooh, hell yeah. I, I wish I could have gotten tickets for the uh, When We Were Young festival. But they're very expensive. It's in, I think, LA or no, Las Vegas. And uh, I, I think it would be overwhelming, you know? The squeak was unexpected, but so lovely. Aww. Looking more into old fashion as well. Um, cool femme punk attires. Uh, sleeveless. Uh, I almost heard that as John. John from uh, Attack on Titan. Um jean vest black band shirt boots neon mohawk neon mohawk damn chains any good too that's really going all out for that i i i purse i don't like the look of mohawks i don't think mohawks look cool that's just me when we are young is i think my fav favorite adele song that's not what I meant. But still cool. It was Vegas. Oh, the Nuggies aren't done. You lied to me. Only going for one day, but all the bands I want to see are on that day. Yo, that's fucking awesome. Psh. I got weak dabs. I don't know why y'all want, want to make me dab. I've seen maybe three Mohawks in my life that worked. I... It fits with the with the punk, you know, aesthetic, obviously. But personally, I don't, I don't, I don't like them. You know, that wants me to get an undercut in a mohawk. I've considered, and I'm still considering, get um, getting a sideways cut, where um, either the side of my hair or the side of my head is either cut or it's braided. One of those two, and. Um, the, the other side would be like, you know, long and flowing and like that, so. False nugget information. Um. <clears throat> yeah. Yuki, you are a very good girl. Someone the other day on a girl that made me all blushy. I just don't really like hairstyles that involve less hair. You know? Although, like, well... Maybe not all hairstyles, because I, I like the side cut one. Um, Mohawk is just bald with extra steps. You know? Mine is all 90s or newer punk. Small alt, alt bands. Isn't it bald with fewer steps? <laughs> yeah, that's true. That's a good point. You know, we should have a, a Mari Gold Redeem of what fidget toy I play with. You guys get to choose the fidget toy that I play with. You know, for like the next, you know, until somebody swaps it. I like that. Would y'all would? <laughs> I like that for myself because I like to alternate between the toys. I like I like, I don't know, fidget redeem. Yeah, I'm gonna make that. I'm gonna make that. I have four fidget toys, so far. And you know, I like I like all of them. All of them have their have their unique parts about them. Okay. Um, choose Mari's fidget toy. Uh, choices are Slinky, Fidget Spinner, String, and Hair Tie. Right? 
I don't really play with anything else. Yeah. Um. 750. There you go. Yeah, you can add more. I can add more as they as they come up. As I d discover more ways to to play with things and, and fidget string. I don't know. I think it's fun. It's fun to have other people um, tell me what to play with. We've actually I'll make myself some popcorn. I haven't had popcorn in so long. I should I should have some more. Seen that band at a festival? Oh, Radiohead? They're headlining, apparently they're pretty famous in America. I've heard of Anti-Flag before. I've definitely heard of them, like, a decent amount of times. Not just from... from you, but from a couple people. You know? They have good music, just not something I would listen to. Although, still a cat. Just because I like to play with string doesn't mean I'm a cat. What? How do cats play with string? Like, what do they do? They don't have fingers. <laughs> Meowmer? What's a Meowmer? <laughs> Ferocious dog. Ooh. She got me grapes. <laughs> she called me my leash. <laughs> oh, right now. Oh, for dinner. Okay. Okay. That's a small. That goes meow. Well, like a cat. You want me to play with a cat? We don't have a cat. I would love a cat. But they cost, uh, they cost money. I may be on the spectrum, which makes... Makes a lot of... A lot of things make sense. Hmm. What, which, um... Which spectrum? There are multiple spectrums. There goes, uh, all my makeup. Oh, autism. Okay, okay. Apparently, I also might be on the spectrum. At least I'm showing symptoms that y'all have seen in, in other people. Um, but yeah. I'm gonna go into therapy soon, hopefully. And, um, I'm gonna be like, yo, what the fuck's wrong with me? Jokingly dangle the grapes above your mouth? That would be way too shy. Way too shy. It's okay, Mario, I'll bring my cat, yo? I love cats. We have a dad from Elite Meech. Elite, I have really shitty dabs. I just want you to know that. I can't dab hard because then my hand, I would break my fucking fingers on the wall. Um, I do have stuffed animals. Maybe I should make a redeem for what stuffed animal like to have on my lap or something. 
Just have, ju just have y'all just control my life, you know? Because I don't know how to control it. <laughs> I don't know how to do a reverse stab. trying to get blueberry trying to get one of my um one of my stuffed animals but uh they're on, they're on top of the <laughs> the bed so one sec This is, uh, allow me to introduce, um, my, one of my best friends, Blueberry. Blueberry has gotten me through many, many nights, many scary nights, um, and, uh, it's not a rat! Although I would like a rat plushie. Um, Blueberry is, a a narwhal? A, a narwhal? Unicorn hybrid something like that um, And they're very they're very cuddleable so I uh, I hug on to blueberry every night So they're my main like sleep Sleep st a stuffed animal The tail threw me off um, I don't think anyone has a good dab honestly fair fair um, I don't have a cat plushie. I have a fox plushie. Um, probably not bring her. She hates. <laughs> I'm sorry, Blueberry. I sneezed all over you. Thank you for the bless you. Yeah, no, don't bring your cat in the car. So fascinating how so many trans people are on are also on the autism spectrum scientists still don't know for sure if this is a coincidence or not i think a lot of people probably are uh and they don't know it and a lot of people probably aren't and they think they are there's a lot of uh, misinformation i wouldn't say it directly re relates to trans people I think the experiences they go through maybe. <gasps> Her face like popped in the stream and just she said nugget. Look how look how fancy this is. Why did they poop in, in this cup here? This looks like fucking Mmm. <laughs> look how fancy this is. Nugget delivery. High class gourmet shit. Blueberry is named after a color. Blueberry is named Come. blueberry because they're blueberry. I don't know. Squidward has a good dabble. This is true. I'm a girl. What sauce is that? Fucking doo doo sauce. That's what it is. It looks like fucking doo doo. No, it's a. Um, it's a uh, barbecue. Barbecue sauce, it looks like that. They gave me a whole thing of barbecue sauce. I can't eat all that. That's a whole ass thing. Yes, uh, those those um, sound effects commands are for subs only. Um, if you're a dom, you're not allowed to use not allowed to use it. Nope. Subs only. 
That means I'm allowed to use it. My God. These bitches gay. <laughs> I can't believe this. Good for them. Trans rights. Trans rights. I made it dippable, I'm sorry. You know what else you can make dippable? I don't know what that means. <laughs> I tried. Let's try it. Nothing dipping for me, and you know it. What? <laughs> Dip a cock in chocolate to enhance flavor. God, I would throw up. If food was involved in sex, I would absolutely throw up. It doesn't matter if it's on me or another person. You know. I would hate that. Thank you, John Halo announcer. Yo, is that the the master the master chef in, in the um, the master chief that announced that? That's crazy. He can talk. What kind of nuggies are those? They're nuggy nuggies. I don't know. They're they're uh, chicken nuggies. Yeah, there we go. They're oven fresh. Such a good girl. Oh yeah, y'all put your chicken nuggies in the oven. Y'all are weird. I put mine in a microwave. I don't really taste a difference. Well, I do taste a difference. But it's not much of an improvement that warrants spending an extra 30 minutes to to to, to bake them in, in the oven. Bake? No, cook. You don't bake chicken nuggies. Clearly, you don't own an air fryer. Oh, I'm sorry. I, you know, may not be the freaking bougie fucking air fryer owner with, with money. I always bake them. It just takes too long. And when I want food, I just want it now. I don't have patience, you know, just to make the chicken nuggies taste better. They're chicken nuggies. You get what you get, you know? How long do air fryers take? And why do they fry the air? This is weird. Uh, sneeze. Uh, I hate today. Out of all days, I was lazy. Well, I wasn't lazy, but I didn't stream all last week. And I was fine. Well, I wasn't fine, but I wasn't sick. And of course, I get sick on a Saturday. I don't. I don't really mind though. We're still. We're still having fun. to 10 minutes damn that's crazy i don't think I, I've, I've never really seen one you season them they do taste very good i have like this addiction to ketchup i don't know why i like I need ketchup on like everything. Anything chicken and most potatoes, I need ketchup, except for McDonald's french fries. I don't know why, it's very specific. They're, they're, not, they're not actually like potato fries, you know? There's something in, else entirely that doesn't warrant putting ketchup on it. But like I eat a fuck ton of ketchup, I remember I got made fun of in uh, elementary school for getting, like, an enormous amount of ketchup packets 
from my elementary school at lunch and using all of it like if it was chicken nuggets i would dump the whole nugget in the fucking ketchup thing and i would get made fun of and people would say you know i'm gonna get diabetes or something and i'm like i don't even know what that means i just like i just like ketchup ketchup because I ate it all that's exactly why we don't have ketchup I use the whole bottle for one chicken nugget I just kind of downed the bottle and then put a chicken nugget in my mouth I just get cups of ketchup <clears throat> you know you know what you do with uh, with with uh, cool whip you put the cool whip in your mouth I do that for ketchup. Just fucking psh, squeeze it. <laughs> God. <laughs> I don't. I don't. Probably would if somebody dared me, though. I, abso I absolutely would do it if somebody dared me. Imagine ketchup shaming youth. Re <laughs> youth really is wasted on the young. <laughs> like me with iced tea if I run out of iced tea something is horribly horribly wrong I used to uh, drink iced tea like religiously to the point where um, I wouldn't drink water but iced tea was very sugary and I didn't like it if it wasn't sugary so kind of forced myself to stop drinking iced tea and really any sugary drink I'm actually really proud of myself for more or less avoiding soda just entirely and really any drink except for alcohol <laughs> uh, alcohol is, an, is a different beast you know I'll fight that another day um, but other than that I just drink a lot of water even if somebody asks me if I want something else I usually just want water unless I'm out like you know getting dinner at like a restaurant I'll get lemonade or Sprite I'll give you $10 if you squirt the next bottle of ketchup. We get directly into your mouth. See, but you can't dare me. You can't give me money. Because, uh, like, that money gets, it gets used for rent anyway. You know? Mario, we are the same person. Because we both like ketchup and tomatoes. Fun fact. I used to hate tomatoes. I used to, you know, I, I love ketchup. But I hated tomatoes. I didn't like tomatoes on my burgers, nothing. I was like, ugh, no. I was a fucking weird ass kid. Speaking of alcohol, turned 21 recently, so I had my first drink. This was interesting. So, uh, how bad did it taste? How, mu how much did you wanna, did you wanna nearly gag? Depends what you drank, but. My first couple times drinking alcohol was, uh, unless it's a cocktail. Usually if it's a cocktail, it, you know, it's pretty good. But I'm, I'm the type of person that drinks straight up vodka because I'm too lazy to make a cocktail and I also don't know how to. I did make a lemonade uh, vodka mix though before. That was very good. It was dangerously good because there was a lot of shots in there. my first drink when I was 12 had a whole glass of wine damn the one I had was okay still didn't taste good been downhill since I mean I think I probably had mine when I was like 14 or something but that was for church so yeah 
Um, my first real drink, probably when I was 18, um, went to Mexico, and the legal drinking age there is 18, so... Um, I was very against alcohol for the most part, I, you know, mainly for the legality sake of it. Um, when I was young, even if, even if somebody asked me, because I would get asked if I, if I wanted any, and I'd be like, no, I am, I am way too innocent. Speaking of which, I found my BDSM test that I took a while ago, m multiple years ago. I won't say when, but multiple years ago, th before I transitioned. How about? And my first thought was like, holy shit. I was very vanilla. <laughs> like 90% vanilla. No, I can't show it on stream. 90% vanilla. Yeah. I'm having alcohol. Do you want Grace to make you something? Not for stream. Maybe, maybe for for the pizza for uh, for later. Try Jack Daniels for the first time. Not my thing. You want to try it with some Coke? Okay, okay. God, I. Okay. Beer is still something I don't really like. I could have a beer. Um. Fucking. Uh. What's that? What's that? Uh. That popular beer company that is popular in uh. Mexico. Um, was it Corona? Is that the one? I don't remember. Either way, that's like, you know, I could drink it, but I won't really super enjoy it. Uh, I usually drink it for like social stuff, I guess. How my first alcohol like 17 during school it's only a small amount of vodka mixed with uh, cola but still okay i am like i am a firm be like believer of of uh, being like very against alcohol usage at a young age um that you know alcohol at any age is is fucking terrible the shit that it does to your body and your mind permanently um or even short term is very scary um and uh yeah but that that kind of you know is a lot worse for for, for kids and basically anybody that still has a developing brain so i would say 21 is a good age I know there's a lot of European companies or companies, European like states or <laughs> countries uh, that have it at 18. Um, but I think 21 is a pretty pretty fair age because it it does impact a lot of like your your growth. Same for weed. I smoke a fuck ton of weed now, but. I I was very against it when I was when I was little, and I'm I'm still against uh, kids having weed. I guess not against it. I don't really care. I just want them. I just want people to realize what it does to you when you're young, because it does have effects on your permanent uh, effects on your brain. Um, alcoholic ketchup. I hate that. I hate that. I was, uh, like, that when I was younger, I tried alcohol my 21st birthday. Huge disappointment. You didn't like, like, the alcohol that you tried on your 21st birthday? You, like, you thought it was gonna be better? It, I mean, it depends what you have. Never drank no drugs. Or smoked. Or shaved off my beer, I'd look 21 in late 20s. Well, damn! You've never drank alcohol and you're, and you're in the late, you're in your late 20s. Good for you. That is amazing. Father of my first chief insisted we drink together. I had the hardest time not spitting it, not spitting it out. So you did drink, but that like that wasn't like 
That was like almost forced, right? Um, it wasn't even my own idea. Classmate brought vodka and decided to join in. Never been a heavy drinker though, mostly 4.5% cider. Even then, it's mostly just social drinking with family and friends. I get that. I'm definitely not a heavy drinker either. I uh, I can't drink heavy because like I I don't know. Um, it really depends what I'm drinking, but for the most part, um, I get drunk pretty fast. I'm very lightweight um, in terms of alcohol, so I can I'm like I have pretty good self awareness. I would say when it comes to it, at least now. Um, I won't. I won't let myself drink to where I, I throw up. I don't think I've ever uh, thrown up before uh, from getting like stupid drunk. Come close, come close, but bagel bites? No, bagel bites are, are, are no. I might be crucified for this. But I, I think they're they're pretty damn gross. What? Oh no. Yeah, I'm, I think it's because I associate bagel bites now with uh, what I had in like elementary school. We had so many bagel bites in elementary school. Daddy! Like pizza bagel bites. Yo, six months call on my eight high. Yo! Half a year! Chloe! Hell yeah! To you! A toast! You. You gotta get a chicken nugget, though. Uh, it's only gonna work if you get a chicken nugget. So you gotta get a chicken nugget, Chloe, and you gotta dip it in barbecue sauce, and then we can toast. Okay? A toast! today getting a nugget nugget with barbecue hell yeah nugget toast where it's at i'm just imagining a scenario where it's like a group of friends um there's like a party tray of chicken nuggets in the middle with barbecue sauce and they want to do like a little toast it's a very heartfelt toast you know somebody like like clicks the chicken nugget to, to like make a sound or something um like they hit with the glass and they all just touch chicken nuggies it's like a circle of chicken nugget touching anyway i don't know what i'm talking about i'm doing a few single glasses but never any drugs i'm okay with other with others enjoying themselves but i prefer to spend that money on video games very fair uh, I wish. I wish I could do the same. Um. But I'm hooked. I've done the sippies. You've done the sippies, Avil? <laughs> tree has consumed. The tree. You just had a nugget that handy? Just pulling out a nugget? Out of their pocket, you know, like fucking um, Napoleon Dynamite. Was it Nuggets? No, he pulled out um, Tater Tots. God, I miss Napoleon Dynamite. I loved that show. Like when I was like fucking what? I guess preteen, elementary school. The Tot Pocket. I might rewatch it one day. It's a good show. I mean, not show, fucking movie. God damn it. If you haven't watched Napoleon Dynamite, do yourself a favor and watch that, watch that movie. 
Doing good. Uh, just vibing and playing some games on my day off. How are you? Hell yeah. Give some, uh, get some relaxing vibes in there. Um, I'm doing pretty good. I, I feel like I'm being treated like a princess today because they gave me a bowl of chicken nuggies. I got an apple, a big apple, a good apple. Uh, Trine gave me piercings, fake piercings. And we got rat squeak and we got, you know, I got blueberry here with me. It's nice because I don't know. I want to I want to be like comfy vibes right now because I'm sick. <laughs> Tater tots like hash browns. Yeah, they're like bite sized hash browns. They're so good. Vote for Pedro. <laughs> I want tater tots. Yes. <gasps> what is this nonsense? You missed your head pat. You missed. How could you? It's okay. I'll fix it. Yay. You're ahead of. You were head patting the Mari figure. Oh, that's about to fall. You're head patting the Mari figure. I want to get more. I want to. I need more. I want to. I want a shrine dedicated to Mari. Mari made me trans. You can thank you can thank her for making me trans. No, you can't have my chicken nuggets. Stinky rat. People are not going to understand that out of context. I want you to introduce me to Jammy Rokai. Rokai. I don't know what that is. Um. made me happy. Aww. <laughs> Walrus. <laughs> again. We're not doing this again. Stream Mari, chat Mari, Mari, figurine Mari. Yeah, there's so many. Katrina. I saw. Yeah, I saw. Is this like dinner? Like, what is this? I guess I didn't really- I didn't eat lunch, so... I gotta stop eating candy. It's really fucking with my teeth. Absolutely not air. Aww. eat snacks um aside from candy but generally I just eat my meals every day 
and that's it. I eat two to three meals every day, and sometimes I'll have a snack. But for the most part, I don't really care. Mm-hmm. Good job, Trina. Yeah. Um. Mm hmm. I don't even know what to do anymore. I don't even know what to do anymore. I don't even. <laughs> Grapes? Oh, yeah. I'm eating way too much. So I'm gonna be eating pizza later. I don't really like when I eat a lot of snacks, because then it... Either way, I'm gonna be eating a meal. About that, Zagreus. About that. I was here watching the stream with me. Aww. I gotta sneeze. <sighs> Thank you. Thank you. We have a we have a co-star here. Maybe your your can can make friends with my with with Blueberry. Perhaps. Um What time is it? Here comes the what? girl. What me? Hello girl. Me? Welcome. That's crazy. What? Here she is. Oh, you mean blueberry? She is here. Yeah, no, you mean blueberry. Blueberry goes by they, them. And yes, I have pronouns for all my, my, uh, My battery died. Oops. Can somebody type uh, the hype command? I want to see what it looks like without. Oh my god! <laughs> Yo! Horror movie? Now we're hype. Right? This is cool as hell. So, I do want to say, I mean, I can turn this up, I think, right? Does this, does this work? Yeah, oh my goodness. It actually looks not too bad. She looks really good. Um, Mario at the disco. Um, I was gonna say, uh, fucking, oh yeah, so, tomorrow, Hopefully tomorrow, um, I'm gonna have a surprise for all of you. Um, I'm not gonna say what it is. It's going to be on stream, so you'll see on stream what the surprise is. And uh, it's a very big deal to me. Um, it's thanks to, to, to somebody that is very, very kind. And uh, I'm very excited to show all of you um so i hope y'all can check that out tomorrow on uh, on stream if you are available but yeah surprise i'm excited i'm really excited it's been something i've been trying to do or trying to get for a long time Woo! Yeah! Baby, that's what I've been waiting for. That's what it's all about. Woo! I should make it. I should make the lights go off with the woo command. Hell yeah! Now we got business. I could. I could. Oh my god. No, Chloe. I could have animations for each command, like lighting animations. Like, oh my god. That could be really cool. 
bang um. up the butt. Okay, well, uh, hold on. Maybe not for those. Maybe not for her. Or, or for those. But, um... For easy... No! Please! No! God! Guys! Trans rights! For that? Like, to flash all through all the colors on the flag? Oh my goodness. That would be so cool. It would take a little while do to do, but... Do you think anything? Do you have thoughts? Do you think about stuff? You just smile. You just smile and don't think. I just smile. I don't know why I'm thumbs doing thumbs up a lot lately. Um, Beep Bob, welcome to the stream. Thank you so much for following. Hello, hello. Welcome to dumb, dumb energy. <laughs> dumb bitch energy. Dumb sick bitch energy. Hope you're having a good day today. Finger guns. That's what I meant to do. Not thumbs up. I like finger guns better. Psh, psh, psh. Um, but yeah, that'll be tomorrow. Um, very excited. And, uh, also hoping that tomorrow will be a drum stream. Um, I haven't been practicing enough lately, though. Um, but a drum stream would be very cool. And, uh, thing is, I need a tripod in order to do a drum stream. Um, and I did buy one online. But it's, uh, I don't know if it will be here by tomorrow. We could have the lights flash the USSR colors. Although, I don't know, maybe... Mm, I feel like that might be insensitive. Uh, during, uh, during, uh, you know, whatever is going on. We run through piano after a repair dude leaves. Oh yeah, I won't be doing piano streams anymore. I think I did a couple piano streams. Um, those are interesting. Oh, we got the desk set up. <laughs> Fuck. Okay. Wizard, feel free to put it on the Discord, because I'm not going to remember. But also, I think I'm going to end the stream. <laughs> um... I'm starting to feel a little uncomfortable uh, being sick, and it feels like my sickness is getting worse. My room is getting very hot, and that's only making it worse for me. Um, I don't know if I want to do piano streams, though. Maybe. I don't know. Um, but either way, I know it's gonna, this is a bit of a short stream today, but uh, my, my sickness is really annoying right now. And uh, I can't act the way that I want to act right now or do the things I want to do while being sick so still I'm glad I streamed today got glad I got to see all of you thank you all for being here this was heckin nice it was really nice to talk to everybody today um Mardrill. You got here at the end. We're at the end of the stream. No. Marjorie, I'll be live again tomorrow uh, at 3 p.m. Eastern time. If you want to come hang out and, and catch up. I have a very special stream tomorrow, actually. Um, showing off a very cool surprise to everybody. So um, if you uh, if you want to catch up, um, you can totally uh, talk uh, tomorrow. Um, and yeah, Rotten 3.0. By the way, about Rotten 3.0. Uh, once the hotfix is released and the uh, server pack is out for the hotfix, um, I will be making a community server for for Rotten for all my shinies, and I will be streaming it. Um, so whenever that's out, um, I'm gonna be streaming it. I'm, I can't wait. I'm probably gonna be streaming it a lot because I kind of get and I just kind of get addicted for for a little while. Um, so anyway. I love all of you. Marjorie, it's nice seeing you again. I hope to see you around tomorrow or around in the Discord or wherever you'd like. Um, that did happen, yes. But I'll see you all tomorrow. Thanks for hanging, for, for, thanks for hanging out. I love you. Bye. <laughs>
Trip, 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 trip.